As a prelude to the forthcoming gubernatorial election scheduled for 21st November 2015, Wada Frontiers, made up of leaders, supporters, and admirers of Wada's administration, from Kogi East converged on Aingba to brainstorm on ways of achieving election victory for the party. The achievements of the Wada administration in the political landscape of the state in the last three and a half years came to the fore, and participants at the summit resolved to support and encourage the governor by giving him another mandate to consolidate on the gains. Representatives of West and Central Central Districts expressed satisfaction with the performance of Captain Wada's administration, given the paucity of fund at its disposal. May I at this juncture commend Your Excellency Captain Idris Wada for doing the PDP proud. It behoves upon all of us here to make sure that we support our great party so that the dividends of democracy will continue to roll in for all of us here. But this is the summit. It's not a rally. Yeah. Well, the day we are going out for rally, you will see whether our is accepted or not. This is a very successful summit. You can see the quality of politicians that we have gathered from the nine local government areas that make up uh, Kogi East and Etheria districts. For the governor, the political summit was a noble idea as it brought together prominent sons and daughters of the land to discuss their future. It was an opportunity for the governor to also present his scorecard while reassuring the gathering of his resolve to remain focused and committed to delivering democracy dividends. We find people who are God-fearing, people who are sincere, and people who have a sense of purpose and direction. Again, I submit that I belong to that category. Governor took time off to inspect ongoing work on Kogi State University Teaching Hospital, Aimba. <laughs>